Hey everyone, Shaver 1000 here. Got another, I guess I'll put it under flea market finds. Anyway, uh, went to a yard sale this morning and uh, picked up a couple things. I'll show you what I got and I'll tell you what we're going to be doing tomorrow. So stick around. Okay guys, so I got these bearing buddies, buddies, they're bearing covers for your boat trailer. If you have the bearing buddies on it, that's where you don't have to take your bearings out to grease them. You just pull this cap off. There's a, uh, a grease fitting underneath there and you just grease them and Take the cover back on. So I bought these. They were a dollar. Let's see what else I got. I got webcam. Don't need it, but uh, you know I collect cameras. Thought it was cool for a dollar. I just picked it up and I looked at it. You know, because I usually don't buy webcams. I don't use them. I use this as my webcam. Um, the camera I'm using now, my Sony AX53. Um, but I just picked it up and looked at it. And he said, it's a dollar. All right. <laughs> I'll give you a dollar for it. And you got an app with it 1080p. You know, this is more than just a webcam. See anything from anywhere. 1080p, night vision, two-way audio. That's a camera. Oh, I thought it was a, a... I thought it was a webcam. So if this works, that's a score. Right? I mean, there's a dollar. Even if I don't, I can put it in with my camera collection. Still got the sticky thing, the cover on it. W Y Z E cam V2 black. Oh, we'll have to check this out later. Okay, so that's cool. And I got this because mine don't work right. I ask him, <laughs> he's one of those guys, everything you pick up, you know what that is, right? No, I'm just interested in something, I don't know what it is. <laughs> he says, you know what that is, right? I said, yeah, I've got several, mine don't work right. I said, does this work? He said, yeah, I said, mind if I go check it? He said, no, go ahead, so I checked it and it works. One dollar. Guys, and he's got usually nice stuff. Like most of his stuff is really, really nice, but very cheap. I'm kicking myself in hind end because he had a jump box for 20 bucks. I should have bought it. I could have got it cheaper. Nice, just a smaller one. I should have bought and put in the boat. If he has that yard sale tomorrow, maybe I'll. I'll stop in and, and see him, uh, see if he still got it. But, so, he had a uh, nice, he had a nice uh, parts washer. Gearheads and mechanics know what I'm talking about. It's, it's a big bin, it's got a lid, and it's got a pump in it and a brush, and you put your solvent or whatever you're using in it. And he said he gave like 130 bucks for it, and I've seen them before, and I think that I think he's about right about what they cost brand new. He said I used it one time, but well, the outside sure looked like it. But the way you can tell is I opened it up, and I opened it up, and it didn't even hardly look like it was used one time on the inside. 
and uh, he had another uh, couple gallon jug of some kind of cleaning solvent which he said it cost 75 which yeah that stuff's not cheap he said 75 bucks you can have it but I don't have a place for it if I did I definitely would have bought, bought that parts washer I probably could put it outside and put a cover on it and I seen this Hey, you guys know what this is, right? That's why you say, you know what this is, right? I said, yeah, I, I know what this is. Our, our home pretty much operates on one. It's uh, one of the first ones, kind of just like like the one we got. Uh, it's an Am Amazon Echo Dot Alexa. So, people across the street's moving out. So, but, uh, I still got the Amazon Q, but I thought for a dollar, the reason why I bought it, because I'm sure this is probably linked to someone's account, but I thought for a dollar, I mean, you know, that and that cord's worth the buck, you know, I mean, so I always pick these up whenever I can, especially for a buck. I got this thing. For camping one of those you turn it off and you crank this up little lantern you wind it up for like two minutes and there you go it on or it comes with a cord you can plug it in and charge it up before you go and that way when you run out of charge you can just crank it and charge it up so uh, he had two on this and then when I bought something else here he let me have this other stuff let's see one two three four five he let me have everything else for a dollar because I paid up for this not really. I mean, when I tell you the price, I didn't really pay up for it. Pittsburgh, it's just, uh, oh shoot, what do you call it? Oh, you know, where you buy tools really cheap? Harbor Freight. But they're all there. He said 10 bucks. And they were all there, so I said, yeah, I'll give you a tenth for that. So he let me have everything else for a dollar, so. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, all right. So that was my yard sale day. Also got, let me grab something here. Kind of in between here with this window up because of the cause of wind blowing. All right, so we got registration for the boat, for our new boat, and registration for the trailer. So um, I wanted to get a smaller tag because our other tag, the full size tag, the way I had to have it put on there to where a light would be shining on it at night, uh, what the hell? The, uh, the roller would cover half of it up. And you can't have that. They, they can pull you over for that. So I asked if I can get a little one. They was like, yeah, we always offer that for on boat trailers if you want a little one, like a motorcycle tag. And I said, well, they didn't offer us on the other one. That's why it's got such a big one on it. She goes, oh, well, they should have. But, yeah, so got a little tag there. So I'll get these put on. We're going to go boating tomorrow. We're going to take the new boat out again and try it out. Well, we've already tried it out, but we're actually just going to go out because we want to go boating. So, um, yeah, like I said last time, that thing was a pain to load on the trailer, man. So I paid attention when we loaded about how far, how deep in the water it was and everything. So it'll be 
a little easier to load tomorrow but I do have rollers ordered so they should be here next week so that'll be good ordered some trumpet air horn or, well they're not air horns they're electric horns but trumpet boat horns uh, they're chrome so they're probably plastic chrome plated plastic but that's all right they should look pretty good on there hope I didn't get two big ones but it'll be all right so those will be in next week too they're shipped they're coming out of uh, California so they should be here by Wednesday and tonight I'm gonna order stuff for that guy's mini bike over there the Coleman mini bike and we're gonna get started on that so he can get get a Get in that race with his buddy. He's got fifty dollars on it. So, <laughs> so, uh, but the guy I'm working on, the guy I worked on the buggy for, and the uh, the zero turn mower. What's well, his buddy? His buddy, his buddy uh, works works for him. The guy that has the mini bike works for him, and he said, you know. He's paying for everything for that guy's mini bike. And so I called him down. So I just wanted to clear everything because I'm going to order him parts today for that mini bike for JD. And he said, uh, Yeah, he said, No problem. He said, Get what you need, you know, whatever he wants. Just go ahead and get it. I'll reimburse you. I said, Cool. So I might go with a stage two kit on it or something. But I'm going to build it the way I would build it for me, you know, because this guy's like six foot two. <laughs> like 200 pounds so I'm gonna build him a decent little bike so that'll be fun um, yeah so that's that's what's going on so stay tuned for some more boating videos tomorrow we're gonna go somewhere different so I think we're gonna go around the Denellum Florida area somewhere up around there maybe the Rainbow River or something like that so I right, guys just wanted to share my little treasures with you I thought you know 15 bucks yeah I'll buy that stuff Oh, man, I, I started thinking, man, after we left there, we headed up to the DMV to get that stuff straightened out. And I told her, I said, kicking myself in the rear, she was like, yeah, you should have bought that that jump box, huh? I said, yeah, I should have bought that jump box. Because <laughs> he had 20 on it. I know I probably could have got it for 15. In really good shape, but I guess it was a small one, but still just have to throw in the boat you know to have in the boat because you never know your battery goes dead or you know you leave something on you don't realize it and and that engine don't have a pull start with it it's just electric there's no you can't there's a, a lot of them the, a lot of those 30 horse johnsons they were electric start or pull start so if your battery went dead you just pull started it not that one it's electric start only so and if our battery goes dead, well, we can't use a trolling motor, so we're kind of stuck. So I should have, yeah. I think I'll take a run up there tomorrow, see if he still got it. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, watch out for Monkey. She's got, a, she's got another T-Move video coming up this evening. So anyway, guys. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Shea Bear, the Myth, the Man, the Legend. Golf for now. Happy... Uh, Memorial Day everyone and uh, yeah we'll see you in the next one yeah it is Memorial Day right yeah yeah holiday weekend three day weekend for most people uh, so yeah so I think Monday uh, I don't know I think Sunday she wants me to cook some ribs I might bring you along with me on that but I'll definitely bring you with me on the boat ride tomorrow so like I said, we'll try, we're going to some place we've, we've never had any of our boats in, so it should be exciting. If not, it'll still be fun getting out on the water and enjoying a nice weekend. It's supposed to be nice all weekend, so we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye, guys. Take care. Stay safe, everyone.